Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We are getting ready to head out to my nephew's birthday party here in a little bit. Um, but before we go, I wanted to run this air refresher that I use a lot through my car. And I thought, you know what, let me grab the camera real quick and do a quick little video for you guys and share information about this product because I absolutely love it. I use it all the time. Um, and before I go any further, let me just say that this is a, not a sponsored video. This is just a product that I've used, like I said, for quite some time now and I absolutely love it and I tell everybody to use it. My daughter uses it in her car, my two sons use it, my aunt is going to use it. She hasn't yet, but she's going to. Um, and what I'm talking about is the McGuire's. Here we go. Oh, will that focus? Focus! Um, it's made by McGuire. There you go. Oh, there you go. It's made by McGuire, and it's called the Whole Car Air Refresher Odor Eliminator Mist. I can't get that to focus. Sorry, guys, I'm trying. I don't know why I won't. Okay, let's see if I can get it to focus. No? Oh, maybe. Okay, the camera's not cooperating today. Um, but it's called the Whole Car Air Refresher Odor Eliminator Mist. This thing works with the air conditioning system in your car. So what you do is, it kind of reminds me of like when you set off a bug bomb in your house, you press the tab and the mist comes out and you quick gotta get out of there. It's kind of the same thing. Um, they recommend that you clean your entire car before you do this, which I think that's what people would do anyway. Um, but I usually clean from top to bottom. So I do my windows first, then I'll clean the dashboard and then I'll vacuum out my car and my floor mats and then run this. And the way it works is it gets through your entire ventilation system. So the mist gets dragged in through the ventilation system, goes across the headliner, and then comes out through the vents that are at the bottom uh, or underneath your dash and the vents that are um, where the defrost would come out, like in front of the windshield on the top of the dash. And it basically cir circulates through your car and it gets literally in every nook and cranny. It runs for about 15 minutes. I usually let it go for about 20. Um, you just wait until the can empties itself. Um, like I said, I usually wait about 20 minutes and you go out and your car literally smells like a brand new car. Like it just came off the assembly line. Um, now there are several different scents that they use. Um, I don't particularly care for, you know, flowery kind of smells, um, but they do have the new car scent, which is what I use. Um, now be careful if you go out and get it. There is, I've been tricked twice, um, there is a scent out there that says fresh new car scent. Not that one, that's too flowery. Um, unless that's your thing and you like it, then by all means, for me, I hated it. And it happened when I really wasn't paying attention. I thought I was grabbing the right box and I didn't. But you definitely want to get the one that just says new car smell. And that'll give you that smell of, like I said, like your car just rolled off the assembly line. And the thing that I was worried about in the beginning with this is that it was going to leave like an oily film or residue in my car and let me tell you it doesn't that you could the only time or the only way you can tell that this has been in your car is because of the scent that you get so don't worry about it leaving any residue or film on any of your dashboards or your seats um, it doesn't do that so I'm going to go out here get the car running. Um, you have to turn your air conditioning on. I turn it down to the lowest temperature it can go and then I turn the fan all the way up and I hit the recycle button uh, before I get this going. So I'm gonna head out to the car and get that ready and then 
we'll get this started. So come on, let's go to the car. Okay, so we're in my car, and like I said, I'm gonna get ready to use this product. And when you open the box and take it out, the only thing in there is this little can. And this is all you're going to need. Just this one little can. And they even say on the box, one can is all you need. Do not use more than one can at one time. Um, so if you have a bigger like SUV or minivan, um, I'm assuming that this one little can will do that car as well or that size car as well. Um, I'm glad I actually read those instructions because um, I have been thinking of going down and cleaning out or detailing my mom's minivan and I was like, oh, that girl is definitely going to need two of these. So I'm glad I read the box, the instructions um, that said don't do that. So it's always good to read the instructions. So, okay, let me show you how this works. So to begin, you want to make sure that your temperature for your air conditioning is as low as it can go and turn the fan as high as it will go and make sure that the recycle air is on. Okay, once that's done, Take the can, take the lid off, don't shake it. First time I used it, I shook it without, again, reading the instructions. Um, so don't do as I do, read the instructions. Uh, but it was fine. Uh, but don't shake it. And I usually set it right on top here. And before I hit the tab, I grab all the extra trash. Um, I have an extra set of keys in here. I want to take that out as well. Um, any unnecessaries I usually take out of the car. So, so then you just want to step out of your vehicle. So then once your door is open and you are out, you want to press this little tab. You see that on top? You press this little tab until it clicks. Mist coming out. Quick shut your door and let it run. Now the instructions say to let it run for about 15 minutes. I usually give it about 20. But you'll know it's done when you come out and there is no more mist coming out of the can. But look at that working. Okay, so as you can see, it's been about 20 minutes, um, but as you can see, the can is done. There's no more mist coming out. And guys, let me tell you, I can smell it just on the perimeter of my car. So then what you do, oh, yes, there's that smell that I love. So then what I do is I just turn everything off so that's it that's all there is to it then you just take your can and throw it away and go about your day um, I absolutely love the way my car smells um, I, I said it before I'll say it again it literally smells like it just rolled off the factory lines um, I wish this thing had smell of vision does anyone remember that from Willy Wonka? No? Yes? Maybe? Um, but I really wish you could smell this car. Um, I, I love it. It smells clean and crisp and brand new. Um, just to give you an idea of how well this thing really works, um, when we purchased my daughter's car, um, obviously it was used, um, but we purchased it from a car dealer. And when we picked it up, they, you know, did the whole spiel. And it was actually kept in really good condition. Um, it only had one owner. They were meticulous about the records um, and the upkeep of the car. Um, but when we got in the car, we can tell they definitely were a smoker um, because you could just smell it. It was in the carpets. It was 
in the fat like in the seats even though she has leather seats um, you could just tell that it was a smoker that owned the car and God bless them I think they tried really hard to mask it with um, some sort of deodorizer um, and you know it kind of did but it kind of didn't um, so I told her don't worry about it when we get home um, on our way home we stopped and picked up a can of this at Walmart and we brought it home we let it run do its thing and it was gone it just you could not even tell that a smoker had owned the car prior to um, so it, it just whatever smell you think nothing is going to get rid of before you give up all hope definitely go try this Meguiar's um, air mist odor eliminator it's I, I can't sing the praises more I just it, it, the minute I think that there is a wrong odor somewhere I quick run out and pick up another can I'm looking at my husband who is making fun of me um, talking in the car but yeah definitely give it a try if you do end up trying it leave a comment below let me know or if you have tried it before leave a comment below and let me know um, or am I just the only one that's totally obsessed with this product I don't know um, but definitely go out give it a try it only runs about six to eight dollars depending on where you buy it when I bought it at Walmart um, I paid I think like six fifty for it and when I picked it up at Pep Boys I think I paid like eight dollars so definitely go give it a try um, thanks for joining me in my short little review here um, impromptu review if you will um, if you like this video uh, please be sure to give it a thumbs up if you haven't done so already please hit that like and subscribe button and once you hit the subscribe button tap on that little notification bell so that you get notified every time I upload a new video again thanks for joining me and until the next time I hope you all have a great week bye guys